Well, how about we get a move on here? Kill some guys. Uh oh, here comes the flying skull of doom. Hey, I said flying skull of doom go away. And zombie man, if I get hit by you, it's embarrassing. Alright, so today's adventure is not going to be a real long one, I hope. We'll see how I do. So I am a little out of practice, in case you haven't noticed. I am taking a few more hits than I normally would. But, getting to get, uh, get my chops back here, maybe, finally. I shouldn't waste my magic so casually, but, you know. Get back here. Because every little bit of gold helps, my friends. There is a mark of jack by the keyhole. Well, then how about I hit the right button, and actually equip this and head on in. I've used key. I just picture him saying this to nobody, it always makes me laugh. Well, that wasn't smooth, but he's down. He's down for the kids out, as they say. Hey, hey, cut up, bugger. Oh, what the hell, what fresh hell is this? Seriously, game? Ah, I'll get that guy too. I guess I'll get as much bread as I can while I can. You know what I mean? Alright, made the jump. Yeah, jumping in this game has never been my strong suit, that is for sure. Alright, now we're starting to get a feel for it, I says, right before I screw up again, no doubt. Because that's how I roll. Ah, see, that's more like my jumping in this game. <laughs> how badly can I miss? Good, I did get that bread. I was worried it was going to disappear before I had a chance to do anything with it. I hate these guys. They tend to jump over you, but they don't tend to do it in a, that set of a pattern. It's kind of a pain in the ass. Uh, hell are you, I'm just leaving. I'm not dealing with you. Jerk. Oh, for the love of criminy Christ. That was just terribly done. I'm definitely not getting that bread. It's gone. Get off the ladder. Wow, I actually still got it. I guess the items hold on longer than I remembered. Alright, froggy dude. Hey, froggy dude. How's it going? Come on, froggy dude. Want a piece? Want a piece? Yeah, that's what I thought. You don't want none of this. It's all too strong for you. Alright, so we're gonna have to do this smartly. Do I actually have that ability in me today? Don't know. We're making some progress in that regard. Alright! The first boss! Oh my god! It's a dwarf. Yes, believe it or not, that is a dwarf. I think we're safe if we stay up here. Let's see. Yeah, we can do it this way, or we can lob fire into his face as well. Sorry. I get. I don't know if that's fire or not. It's deluge, which is, I guess is supposed to be water, but it doesn't look like water at all. It looks like fireballs to me. Can't really hit this guy, can I? Come on, jerk. Wow, I actually looped the, the boss music I've been fighting him so long. Why don't you die? Just die! There we go. And check out the money for that. We just basically doubled our money on one foe. Awesome sauce. He's holding the Matic. Excellent. So we now have the item we need to move forward. If you recall, we were told about this by people in the know in the last town. Crap. Get out of the freaking hole. Kill the frog guy, get out of the hole. Sounds like a good plan to me. I don't know about you guys, but... Come on, frog dude. Yeah, the frog guys are not near as effective as those goats, that's for sure. Those goats are just filthy, nasty, filthy buggers. Hey, I don't think so. Give me my bread. Alright, let's just run at this guy and get hit by him. And we're out of here. You know, I realize jumping there may not have been the smartest move. Hey, we actually got out of there without him chasing us right over the wall. That's a bonus. There we go. Let's kill guys on the way out. What the hell? Because we're going to need all this gold. Oh, man. You guys aren't even aware of how much gold we're going to need in the next town. It's going to be a little ridiculous. Actually, a whole lot ridiculous, honestly. Even though I am fighting terribly. And remember, once you go out a door that has a key to get in, it doesn't stay unlocked. Just a demo here. There is a mark of jack. So if you have to find a key as opposed to buying one, it can be a real problem trying to uh, move on with your life. Alright, so this is where you go to your items. You'd equip the Matic. And how do we use this again? I can never remember how to use these damn things.
How do I use the damn thing? Down and B, that's what it is. It makes sense. Up and B is your magic, so down and B. Really, guys? What the hell is this? Get off the damn ladder. I'm kind of stuck in the ladder and I'm fighting. This is going well. I'm so glad I stopped to fight them because that was a good idea on my part. Sure it was. Okay, I don't think I even climbed it. Get off the ladder. And yeah, I'm just doing this kind of emergency jumping thing. Check out the penis head up there. Wow, look at him. Doing his thing. Enjoying himself. I don't like these ghost guys. Yeah, you. I don't like you guys. Ah, get away. Stop attacking me. Let's just get off this screen. Why did I jump? That could have been dangerous. I think we just got Mr. Mushroom Breath here to worry about. Oh, he can hop up stuff. Good for him. Wow, he's taking a lot of hits, though. And he gives bread. Cool. I actually need bread, so good on him. Hey, bugger. Still took four hits. Okay, so apparently magic is useless, unless you have a better spell. Whoa. Get away. There's no way I'm going after that. Not with my jumping abilities. That will raise your attack power, like, temporarily. It's one of those, uh, works for a little bit of time sort of items. Whoa, hey. My shield ate that for lunch pretty good. Five hits? Really? Goodness gracious, game. Give the guy a little more credit, why don't you? Oh wow, I jumped right on that one. Anyway, I've made it to the next town despite my horrendous fighting skills. Four paw. Anything like four play? Probably not. Hey dude, what's going on? Dried meat to bring energy for 150. Definitely. Okay, that's a pretty good deal. It means basically we can for 300 we can refill everything, which is more or less like the doctor in the previous town. Alright, let's see what we've got for sale here at the armory. Because this is where the money is going to come into play. We would like... So we want a longsword. We want a studded mail because my defense capabilities suck. Don't need one of those. We... Those are nice, but I think I can find those in, uh, nearby from a, an enemy encounter screen. And we're going to need one of those. So 28, 53, 6900. Well, let's buy a longsword while we're here. Thank you. Alright, so let's quickly... Oh, that's right. They don't let you equip inside the places, because that would be too freaking simple. Hooray, we now have a weapon that's longer. That's a huge deal. Water from three springs flows into the fountain. Wow, a second thing of text for somebody. That's crazy. Church? Yeah, I'm not going to church. The hell with you. How much is the doctor in this place? I guess I should have checked it before I invested in some dried meat. Tower of Fortress. I could have swore I was just in the Tower of Fortress. Ah, shows what I know. Alright. Cool. You could tell me how much gold it is before you just randomly spout that off, jerk. Oh, his wife is at home. Where's your wife? In the sky. Yeah? 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 Hmm, they're bloody expensive. So we're not gonna bother that. And we have a key guy. Let's see, key guy, what do you got for us here? He still looks like the most disinterested gay key maker I've ever seen. So we need to buy one jack key and one queen key, I believe. But the jack key is the more important of the ones. What's out here? Alright, we got dudes. Hey dudes. And they now die at a one hit, which is nice. And the reason I'm not bothering to collect that bread is I'm going to show you something here in a minute. Come on, guys. Someone who knows what they're doing can just, uh, they would exit and enter the screen and get this the first try, because they know the encounters and what time you got to get us. Not screw up the jump. This is injury because of the ointment. So, outside of magic attacks, we're not going to be just gods among men. And here's that open area they were talking about. And it's so nice to be able to just attack stuff willy-nilly like so. 
All right, so we're already up to a thousand. So you can get the money you need fairly quickly around here if you fight those frog guys. And here's what I was, here's the area I was talking about. The problem is with the magic shield, I'm still gonna take damage if those uh, magic and shots hit me. Die already. I think this is the spot with the red uh, potion. I'm just gonna experimentate and see if that's the truth. That is what you really need to happen when you're jumping. All right, we'll try once more. I think it's a round of, like it's a rotation of four is what you need to try to get this. There it is. Wait, is that poison? Let's see, is this poison or not? It looks like poison. Nope, red potion. So we can get as many red potions as we want over here fighting this magician. And then we can go back into town and we can sell them. And red potions refill your life, in case you're wondering. Oh, another item we should probably invest in, even though I think you can get by without buying it, would be um, an elixir. We're gonna need an elixir in this area for a story advancing uh, plot point, so. Let's see, it's pretty easy to kill this guy. So, I mean, you can get your experience and just stock up on red potions to sell in town. It's not a bad deal we got going here. It's a nice little scam we're running. Pretty damn sweet. Anyway, you'll join me back in town once I've purchased all of the necessary items. And probably an elixir to boot, although I think elixirs are bloody expensive. I'm holding something. It's called a controller. Alright, so we are now equipped. We have ourselves a studded mail. We got ourselves a magic shield equipped. We got a deluge. And we now have a wing boot, a queen key, a jack key, and five red potions left over. Those red potions sold for 200 a pop, so they helped. Anyway, let's deal with these guys. Get ourselves an ointment. I believe I've got it timed out properly now to make the ointment appear. Cool. And I even got the jump to work, which is even cooler. Oh, sweet deal, buddy boy -o. Let's do it. Alright, let's uh, put on the wing boots. Is this where I want to go from, is the question? And I think... If you do this, you hold jump, and I think you press up. That's the next screen, that isn't it. Frigging hell. There we go. It's okay, though. We're invincible, so we can... Whew, shoot guys in the face to make the world a better place. So be careful you don't get dinged by their magic, because your shield will do something. And here's the guy we want to find. Ho, ho, ho. Will you now? Okay. Oh no. Um, okay. Um, what? Anyway, the water now flows. So what if the three fountains has begun its path anew? Let's talk to him again, see if he says anything useful. Get the key from the Guri, which is supposed to be Guru, in the Tower of Fortra. And... Search for undiscovered first fountain. Well, if you remember, we saw a key called a Joker key. Power of the ointment is gone. It means our wing boots are soon to be gone, too. And drop like a stone. <laughs> Alright, so now that we've done that, we're in pretty good shape here. Hey, stop hitting me. Just because I'm playing terribly gives you no right to beat the crap out of me. Let's quickly return to town. And, oh, the wing boots are gone. I guess I could have tried to fly up to the top, but, you know, whatever. Just, just go away. Go away, leave me alone. You weird, bouncy, ghosty thing. Come on, frog dude. They're more dangerous when they're not contained by stuff. In case you were wondering what this area looked like, now you're getting a view. Ah, eh, whatever. I'm gonna go visit the, the meat man in a moment, so... Meat man in a moment. Alliteration! Award for me! One... Two... Three. Okay, so when we come back out, it should be an ointment. It should be. We'll see if it is. I suspect it may or may not be. Either one or the other. Those are the two options I suspect we're facing. Sure thing. Let's waste the money and get fully gelled up for our trip. Oh, that is so, so sweet. Also killer weak sweet. Not weak at all. It's just killer. All right, fellas. 
Bring it on. Let's see if I can actually make that jump again. I'm not good at this jump that I have to make. Oh, wow. Third time in a row. Pretty awesome. And yes, I'm abusing the ointment, but you know what? If you know where there's an ointment, by all means, abuse the hell out of it. Where am I going now? This is where my memory starts to fade a little. I made that guy shoot his, shoot his load backwards. I'm going to get up there. And there's a fountain. we got to revive that fountain. But I think that's after you get all three revived that that one will come back to life. Hey. Wow, okay. So I couldn't hit him, but he didn't hit me. I guess that's a fair trade. Whoa, okay. How about you just grab the fountain? Is that guy standing on nothing? I guess he is. Good for him. That guy just stopped him. Damn it. See, this is why being terrible like I am is not a good plan. You're gonna waste your ointment doing nothing important. Oh, this is not the time for this to run out. That was a pretty slick move, I do say so myself. Pretty darn slick. Get away. There we go, made him jump that time, go figure. All right, what kind of key do we have to use here? Mark of Jack, of course it's a Mark of Jack. When is it not a Jack key? And I've used key. Oh my god. Well, now we're in a dangerous place. So let's quickly kill these guys before I embarrass myself too badly. That up there is poison, by the way. I remember that. That's poison. Don't touch the poison. It just hurts you. It's silly. But I think that's a good spot to leave it off. We'll take a look through here and see if we can find the second fountain or the guru or the guri or oops, falling asleep. I don't know. Because that guy said a lot of crap and most of it didn't do us a lick of good. Stupid guy saying crap that don't do us a lick of good after we trusted you. Wait, did we trust him? Oh, maybe. Kind of. Well, he fixed the fountain. Or I did. I don't know. I'm confused. Freaking gurus.